hi everyone we're going to be looking at just bitcoin price update for today a lot has changed ever since our last video so in this video we are going to be looking at the jasmine coin price rsi this is a falling wedge and a falling wedge is usually a bullish sign like i said in the last video we're going to be talking about this falling wedge we are going to be looking at the btc price chart in order to compare it with the jasmine price chart as well and we're going to be looking at the jasmine price update as you can see jasmine drops broke above this trend line which has acted as resistance for us in more than five days we eventually broke above it we're going to be talking about that trend line and what we should expect for the price of jasmine as well the weekly time frame is looking promising as well we're going to be talking about the weekly time frame for jasmine coin as well this is the btc dominance we have dipped to 55 percent which is a good sign we're going to be talking about the btc dominance we're going to be talking about the altcoin to that three market cap excluding ethereum and also btc and um, before i forget um jasmine is also hosting is sponsoring a match uh, on the 3rd of may 2024 so according to the post um um the cfo retweeted and he captioned it he quoted it as um we are excited to announce a number of new initiatives to help boost the japanese football team community so basically they are sponsoring a football team in the japanese um community and um yeah so the match is expected to kickstart 3rd of may 2024 if you ask me this is a strategic marketing you understand no more like a direct but a strategic marketing and um, it's a bullish sign as well i like that i'm looking forward to the game so let's just look at jasmine real quick on coin market cap the price of jasmine is currently sitting at around 0 0.02104 we are up five percent in the last 24 hours market cap is back to one billion dollars which is a good sign we are currently ranked by market cap 88 position out of over 9,000 active cryptocurrencies listed on coin market cap and um, the our trading volume is kind of um gaining momentum gradually we are up 19 percent in the last 24 hours we are currently sitting at 79 million dollars in trading amount uh, of jasmine and also we are ranked number 86th position out of over 9,000 active cryptocurrencies listed on coin market cap which is a bullish bullish sign and um, let's just look at as you can see we've talked about this um jasmine analytics times without number as you can see address is um by time held now if you notice the long-term holders are gradually increasing the last i think the last time we talked about this it was below 50 percent right now it's above 50 percent it's getting to 51 percent already that is to say every day by day a lot of people are choosing to hold on to their jasmine and not to trade it for short-term profit now the 6.6 percent you're seeing here is the number of short-term traders more like day traders you understand and um, yeah and scalpers why the cruisers here which is sitting at 42.3 percent is more like swing traders so as long as the number of our long-term holders continues to increase there's no cause for alarm at all we are still good to go in the long run because the the, the, the this 50.96% 50, 50 is those who have held for more than a year, more than 12 months. The current fear and greed index for the overall cryptocurrency market sentiment is currently sitting at 73%, as you can see over here. And as at the time of recording this video, which is April 22nd, 2024, we are currently at greed. We closed yesterday with greed, last week with um, greed, which is 74, and then last month with greed which is 73 so we are still good to go a lot of people are still believing and hoping to get a reversal in the price of the overall crypto asset which is something you all should be anticipating because let me just show you this important chart real quick now this is the btc um, price chart ever since btc came into existence and um, as you can see after the first BTC halving, which happened in um, um, November 2012, November 2012, we got a massive price push of eight over eight thousand percent to the upside. Now, after the second halving, which happened in July um, 2016, we got a massive price move of BTC to the upside of over two thousand percent, close to three thousand percent. Now, after the third BTC halving, which was in 2020, we got a massive price push of over 500 percent close to 600 percent now the thing is even if we are to get a price push of just 100 percent or 200 percent from where the current price of btc is trading which is around 66 thousand dollars is going to take btc over 
of over $130,000 price target, which BTC can still go 3x, 4x, even 5x. And that is to tell you how the massively our altcoins are yet to move. Now, this is the Jasmine RSI in a falling wedge. The RSI is currently trading in a falling wedge. And a falling wedge is usually a bullish sign and um, a bullish pattern. So, we've broke out of the falling wedge successfully. Remember, I told you guys yesterday, we need to see the falling wedge flipped into a support. A clean support that is a confirmation that we are likely to begin our journey back to the um, um, high at around 94% for the RSI. Now let's just look at the BTC, um, um, sorry, the Jasmine price real quick. I will just talk about the RSI. Now remember I told you guys in the last video that this trend line is likely to act as resistance, you understand, for Jasmine coin, which acted as resistance because the trend line has acted as support. I'm currently on the daily time frame, by the way. It acted as support here, support here, and a massive support here. And if it eventually got broken. Each time a strong support gets broken, it usually acts as a strong resistance. Now, if you are paying attention, let me zoom in so that you pay attention to what I'm about to show you real quick. Now, if you pay attention to this sensitive trend line right here, you will notice when we broke below the trend line, we closed bearish candle, massive bearish candle below it. We have found it very difficult, like more than one, two, three, four. In the last four days of let me just say five days we've been unable to trade back above the trend line now for six days we've been unable to trade back above the trend line it all changed when we formed this um falling wedge in the rsi price of jasmine coin and we've broken above the trend line the upper trend line of the falling wedge already now let's just go back to the jasmine coin price now we've successfully broken above it. Remember, yesterday, we, um, day before yesterday, we were unable to close above it. Yesterday, we were we were still unable to close bullishly above it to confirm um, that we've broken successfully above the resistance. But today, we have now broken above it, and Jasmine is currently trading at around 0 0.02097. We have 13 hours and 39 minutes for this bullish candle to close. The moment this candle is able to close bullishly above this trend line then it's a confirmation that we have successfully flipped this um resistant into a support and we are likely to begin our journey back to the zone we've talked about times without number which which is the zone between 0 0.025 and also 0 0.028 um, respectively like i said like i've said before times without number the moment we are flipping this zone into a support then just expect jasmine coin to begin to head to this zone which is the zone um between 0 0.038 and also 0 0.050 zone this zone is a very 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 significant zone i'm currently on the weekly time frame for the chart you are seeing right now this zone is a very very important zone for jasmine coin to conquer now on the weekly time frame we are looking good like i told you guys uh in the previous video as long as we are not losing this 0 0.0179 and also 0 0.015 there's no cause for alarm at all now we've we closed last week with a bullish candle and we've opened this week with another great bullish candle so we are still left with six days and 14 hours for this week bullish candle to close the moment we are closing this candle bullishly then I think we can start making our way back to the 25, 26, 27 um, um, zone, which is this zone I showed you guys here. So now for we to welcome more price move of Jasmine coin to the upside, we need to successfully flip this zone, which is 0 0.038 and also 0 0.050 zone. We need to successfully flip that zone into a clean support before we can start expecting 0 0.082 and also 0 um, 0.12 cent. And... Um, the mom now the thing is this is the only this is the most significant zone resistance zone for jasmine for now the moment we are conquering this zone our journey to 0 0.082 and also 12 cent is going to be 18 of a walkthrough you understand the moment we're getting to 12 cent is not going to take long before we get to 18 cent respectively for the price of jasmine coin that's just that for that now let's just look at btc dominance real quick the dominance is bleeding which is something we've um expected which is something we've anticipated and we are happy over we need to see the btc dominance bleed massively in order to welcome our altcoin to a massive old season 
you have to hold your horses because we still have a long way to go guys so like i've said thanks to that number we need to see this btc dominance drop to 47 44 and also 40 percent in order to um give room for our altcoin back to pump massively to the upside let's just look at the total three altcoin excluding ethereum and btc now this is the weekly time frame as you can see we haven't still gotten to the all-time high that is the overall altcoin excluding btc and ethereum is yet to get to their all-time high i'm talking about their overall market cap combination not individual meme coin market cap even if it's individual the main the major meme coins in this space like um shiba inu is yet to get to all-time high dogecoin is yet to get all time get to all-time high utility projects such as jasmine as well they are yet to get to their all-time high so we are currently trading at around 675 billion dollars we have six days 14 hours for this candle to close now we have a minor resistance here at around 832 billion dollars for the overall total three altcoin market cap the previous all-time high was around one trillion dollars so the moment we are flipping the one trillion dollar zone into a support is going to be a massive moonshot for overall altcoin market that's the psychological effect it's going to have on our altcoin bag as always my name is isaac please and please invest the amount you can afford to lose nothing is guaranteed in this space and um, yeah so let's just wait and see if jasmine will be able to close this daily candle daily candle above this trend line the moment we are closing this daily candle above this trend line is going to be a bullish sign the moment this, you are seeing this daily candle close bullishly above the trend line and we open the next day candle with another bullish candle then it's certain that we are getting to the zone of 0 0.025 and also 0 0.028 respectively but if we are losing this zone expect jasmine coin price to trade back to 9 0 0.019 and also 0 0.018 zone yeah likewise to btc if btc is not able to flip this resistance it's approaching into a support then we might get a correction back to around sixty four thousand dollar for btc once again as always my name is isaac invest the amount you can afford to lose once again like my video if you haven't already subscribe to my channel in case you're new to my channel and um, peace.